When this first went up, you know, I took photographs and I, I sent it to, to friends at home and, I, and, I, and I'm like, look, look, it still blows my mind. Acting was not even remotely on my horizons. I grew up in a blue collar, working class neighborhood. No one in my street or my school, you know, you didn't be an actor. You went to work in the factory down the road. And 12 years ago, I was standing on pub doors in Dublin, getting guy, drunk guys flicking cigarette butts into my face because I wouldn't let them in. And now I'm taking buys every night, looking down at Hillary Clinton and Martin Scorsese. But my parents were in a pub one night when a bomb went off in the pub. Uh, it was 1975. I think there were three people killed in that. My parents got out, out unscathed. It was just a Saturday night, they were out having a drink. It's around December time. So as much as that sounds all incredibly surreal and abnormal, and it, it is when you look back, it was normality for us. I did a whole Lot, load of jobs, different jobs when I was growing up. And I did nine years in the Royal Navy. I was a helicopter engineer. Didn't like it. Got a succession of dead end jobs. Met my ex wife. We kind of just realized that I was really passionate about film and TV. I went on to do quite a lot of theatre, and I do realize now that theatre is where you learn your craft as an actor. When I was a kid growing up in Ireland, uh, and my aunties would come to visit on a Sunday, and my mum would get the good crockery out and the biscuits and that. And when I look back, I, I think, uh, you know, I used to be the one that would get behind the sofa, and uh, they'd all sit in a circle, and I would get up and do impressions and songs. Well, I boxed in my teens. I had 40 something fights as an amateur. I used to get terrified in the ring, I would freeze being on stage and being in the ring and they are so close, the two, the two things. You're under the spotlight, there's the potential of being humiliated, you're very much stripped down naked, you're on your own uh, and I was determined uh, to not let the nerves ruin my, my acting on stage the way they did the boxing. Because I came into the industry a very unconventional route at a late age, I, I, I just felt it was organically right. It was just serendipity to, to come here, to stay here, and to, and to plan my future here, you know. The show next door, John Lithgow's in it, and I, you know, you, you occasionally bump into him in, in, the, uh, in the, the shared walkway right, right. we have. Again, me, you know, Glenn Spears from Portadown, working class kid. And, and I'm working alongside people like that. In acting terms, I'm probably about 26. I'm still, I'm still in awe of everything. 